We're gonna catch you. Yeah, just a matter of time. Two nights, two different attempts. Why neighbors say a suspected burglar was back on their street just last night. Good evening. Same would be thief, same house, different day. Now, this here is the video that we showed you yesterday on Keloland News as a homeowner caught someone on camera trying to get into his house. Patrick Major says that he and his neighbors are worried about their safety and the security of their homes. Kelloland's Brady Mallory spoke with him and another neighbor today. Brady? Well, this is happening in a southwest Sioux Falls neighborhood. Prairie Hills is just off 69th Street and Louise Avenue. Tonight, neighbors are hoping to catch the person or people who have been trying to break into their houses. <sighs> Patrick Major is finding out what it's like when a visitor just won't leave. Same jacket, uh, wearing different shoes. Uh, he had a backpack on this time. At 3.20 this morning, a person jiggles Major's doorknob to try to get into his house. After having no luck, he walks away and even leaves behind footprints and lots of questions. Uh, I couldn't believe it this time. I just, I was very, very shocked. This happened before. In nearly identical video, it appears the same person pulls the same stunt one day earlier on Monday morning, a little after 4 o'clock. In that video, the man's carrying a little bag. Major says it was filled with bath bombs that the thief took from one of his neighbors. A lot of my neighbors are getting up at uh, two, 2 or 3.30 and waiting for somebody to try to open up their door. In this latest attempt, the person walks down the street to another house. At some point, a car drives by, pulls into this driveway, and then speeds off. Other Kelloland News viewers sent us these videos and images, and it appears to be a person in the same jacket. And in this video, someone tries to get into a truck and runs away when security lights turn on. And a second person is right behind him. I think it's pathetic, especially during the Christmas season and taking people's gifts. I can't imagine somebody doing that. Dwayne Melema lives in this neighborhood. He says he and most of his neighbors do have security cameras. I also have dogs in my house, so I can't imagine anybody would get in my house without knowing um, because of my cameras and my dogs. Major is on alert and says this visitor is wearing out his welcome. We're going to catch you. Yeah, just a matter of time. So, Brady, what are police saying about this case? Yeah, we asked Public Information Officer Sam Clemens, and he says any pictures or videos neighbors have of suspicious behavior, well, please send it to police. Two nights in a row is pretty concerning. Uh, you know, calling police and letting them know, hey, this is what happened. If you have it on video, sharing that video with them, we can hopefully identify him because he wasn't able to get in that house, but there's a good chance that he was breaking into other homes. And he also reminds everyone to lock your house and your cars. If you recognize anyone in these videos, please call police.